folks, Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. We've got an exciting new product that's come in from Kingston Technology. You can find it at kingston.com. That's kingston.com. This is their solid state drive for your computer. Basically, their SSD, now 200 V plus version, I guess. This is a 120 gigabyte, and of course, you can get various models on their website when you go there and check it out. Uh, I'm going to explain here why that's important for a solid state drive and how it's different than a hard drive here in a second. You can see the back. We want to show you the uh, boxing that it came in. Etc., etc., but we'll get into some of the important reasons here as we open up the case. Now, one thing we have been doing is reviewing some of the other cool products from Kingston, like uh, for instance, uh, we've been using their Y Drive for mobile, which is really awesome. So, if you can, check the related posts down in the bottom to uh, click on some of the other products. But now we're going to try their, uh, their drive that's made for a standalone PC. Okay, so now we've got a chance to open up the box. I want to show you how this comes out of the box. Uh, this is basically a great everyday business solid state drive that you can take and use. Now, what a solid state drive is, it's very different than a hard drive. It works off of internal memory chips as opposed to uh, uh, it's a spinning disk with the uh, kind of the record player armature that you've seen, probably seen before. Apple uses this in their computers and laptops now, uh, solid state uh, hard drives, or I should just say drives. Uh, so it's got a looks like a setup disk and some other stuff that we can uh, use to take and make a change over here from uh, our other startup disk or our old hard drive. Looks like we've got some cabling here. Looks like we've also got some uh, disk mounts for inside the computer. This is going to be a fun project. Uh, looks like we've got some wiring, most likely to hook up the uh, disk to our computers. Looks like there's a power cable for inside the computer, and looks like uh, we have. A case here and looks like this is an external sort of case if I imagine if we want to use it externally uh, this is a case that will go ahead and carry it and this is the size of it it's not very big 120 gig uh, of course I come from the old days where uh, 320 megabytes was like the size of a brick so uh, it doesn't seem very, very big to me um, but it works which is really cool um, <clears throat> So one of the great things about a solid state drive and why it's important to maybe get for your business or whatever computer you're using a lot is if you've ever had a drive fall out on you where a drive uh, has a, you know, got a broken armature, someone's dropped the machine, thrown it off, the sectors wear out, et cetera, et cetera. How, a, how the solid state drive works is a, it's a myriad of memory chips that are inside. What you essentially get, since you're not having to wait for the drive to spin up, the drive to speed up and access data is you actually get faster sign up times, faster random access times, uh, faster read latency times uh, where you're not having to wait as long, uh, faster data rate transfer, consistent read performance, there's no fragmentation you're going to get that you would get with a hard drive, there's no noise, there's better temperature control. Um, just, just across the board, a solid state drive is a much better a drive for you to get for storing your data, especially nowadays where they can compress this into such small units. So it's a much better drive overall. It's not going to make the noise. It actually uses less energy, so you're actually going to be helping the environment too, which is really smart. But the beautiful thing is, is like I say, I've had friends, and I've had, a, I think, a few times where we've dropped a hard drive, we've dropped a computer, and it's thrown the armature off on the hard drive, and then you've got to go pay billions of bucks to go have them uh, fix up the hard drive and uh, recover the data if, if it's possible. Um, you know, there's other things where you have uh, the sectors that will wear out, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So it looks like we've got the plugs there in the end. We're going to install this and go through the process and hopefully be speeding up our computer. So uh, we'll be back in a second to give the results. Okay, folks, so we're back. There's one thing I wanted to take and show you. The Kingston comes where you can internally uh, attach this inside your computer or it comes with an external case. You saw this earlier, but I didn't really profile it. But what this is is a place where you can plug this in and you can it comes with a cord that you can plug in. You can take this with you wherever you want. So you can either use this externally or internally, which makes it great. Um, the We've actually put this to the most extreme test that we possibly could because the great thing about solid state is that you don't have a lot of latency time, that it very quickly boots up. You don't have to wait for the disk to go find data and search around 
and uh, it's supposed to boost startup time. So what we actually did is we took the solid state drive from Kingston Technologies, we put a new boot of Windows 7 on it, 64-bit, and we pretty much got it to where it's running its own computer on this hard drive. So we really want to test how fast it would make a difference in booting up, how fast it would make a difference in accessing data, et cetera, et cetera, if it would really live up to the claims of what solid state drives do. I got to tell you, I am blown away and super impressed with solid state drives and the Kingston drive that they have, this SSD now um, drive is amazing. Uh, it, 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 <laughs> let's just put it this way, I have a computer with an older processor in it that takes about five minutes to take and boot up fully and go through and load all the programs and things. This thing's up in like a minute, minute, two minute tops. It just zoom, boom, up from the moment you hit the power button. It is amazing. Um, all the programs we have are running faster, stuff that used to really drag down the machine that you'd always hear the hard drive ramp up for. Uh, this thing, there's none of that. Now, to give you an idea of how cool these are, I, this has been pulled off the machine that's been on all night. Okay, I can hold this in my hand. There's, there's almost little or no heat to it whatsoever. Um, it's not like a hard drive. It doesn't generate heat. It actually saves energy. So if you're an environmental sort of person that's really concerned about that, this is definitely the drive that they can have. But I got to tell you, I only review stuff that I really like on the ChrisVosshow.com. If I don't like it, I send it back. Um, this is a must-have. This is a must-have product. I'm not even kidding you. I'm so blown away. Um, it, what you need to do is you need to go out. You need to get yourself one of these drives and get rid of that crappy hard drive that has the little armature in it. <clears throat> the great thing is, is you can drop these. I mean, obviously, if you dropped it from a certain height or crushed the crap out of it with a, I don't know, a steamroller, you might have some problems. But with these drives, if you drop them, you're not going to throw the armatures off. You're not going to throw the discs off. You're not going to scar the discs. It's all memory chips that's in here, and that's what really makes this thing beautiful. You know, I've lost hard drives. I've damaged data. I've also had bit sectors go bad on me. Um, this thing is amazing, and I really... I've never had a solid state drive before, and I'm completely sold on it. I'm telling all my friends they need to go out and get one. This thing is f super fast. The boot time, the even even turning the machine off. I mean, usually like I have to turn the machine off and just kind of wander off for a while while it slowly, you know, shuts down the programs and whatever. This thing just shuts off. I mean, it just it everything is stored on the chips. It doesn't have to go find data. It doesn't have to put stuff away because it's already put away on the chip. I just can't tell you how blown away I am at solid state drives. I'm, I'm completely now a solid state drive guy. This, I'll never buy another hard disk that spins. Never. So be sure to check it out. It's at kingston.com. That's kingston.com. I can't say enough about it. I'm blown away that I can pull a hard drive out of a computer and it's not burning my hand. I'm sure my old hard drive would be, uh, I'd probably be in the hospital right now if I pulled it out because it runs for 24 hours at a time. So be sure to check it out. Kingston.com. They've got a full line of all sorts of different solid state drives. Super easy to hook up. Super easy to get going with my computer. No big brainer even doing the internal thing. And, uh, of course, you've got the external mounts with it. But uh, be sure to check it out and come to the ChrisVossShow.com often.